Hello everyone and welcome back to Clinical Cousins YouTube channel where we are going to be talking about a drug that many of you might take after a pharmacology exam. Today we're talking about ethanol or ETOH or drinking alcohol or liquor or booze. It is all the same thing. This drug is classified as an antidote and CNS depressant. It is given for methanol toxicity and propylene glycol toxicity. It cannot be given with other CNS depressants or to patients with liver impairment, diabetes, or seizure disorders. In pregnant women, this drug can cause fetal alcohol syndrome, which is characterized by neuro and somatic malformations. What we need to know is that this drug binds allosterically to GABA-A receptors. Remember that GABA-A receptors allow negative chloride ions into our cell, thereby hyperpolarizing them and making them far less excitable. Additionally, al or alcohol or ethanol competes for metabolic pathways within the liver. This is why it is given for methanol and propylene glycol toxicity. Methanol, known as wood alcohol, can be found in homemade moonshine liquor, and propylene glycol is a common food additive. This drug can be toxic to the liver by itself, but the reason that we give it for methanol and propylene glycol toxicity is that ethanol will be metabolized first and will give us time to deal with the methanol and propylene glycol in our system. Now, the side effects of this drug may include ataxia, nausea, vomiting, respiratory depression, and slurred speech. Some commonly tested material about this drug is that it is a commonly used recreational CNS depressant. It has a high potential for abuse. It is the treatment for methanol and propylene glycol toxicity, and it is hepatotoxic. As always, thank you for taking the time to learn with us today, and remember to like and subscribe for more content.